Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation from here? To find the value of x, let's take everything on this side to the left. And we have x raised to the power 6 minus into bracket x minus 5 raised to the power 6 equals to 0 here now. Then let's factor this raised to the power 6 as x raised to the power 3. Then 3 to the power 2, so then 3 that is 6, then minus, same thing here, we have x, x minus 5, then raised to the power 3, which is raised to the power 2, and equals to 0 from here. Then applying difference of 2 squares here, well, we have a square minus b square, this gives us a plus b into bracket and into bracket a minus b then here this becomes a now which is x raised to power 3 plus b which is now into bracket x minus 5 raised to power 3 then close bracket then open bracket a x raised to power 3 minus b now which is into bracket x minus 5 which is raised to the power 3, close bracket, now equals to 0 from here. Then this to multiply and give 0, zero here, each of either of them could be 0, we have the fourth x raised to the power 3 plus into bracket x minus 5 raised to the power 3 equals to 0, or we have x raised to the power 3 minus into bracket x minus 5 raised to the power 3 now equals to 0 from here. Then, on this side, applying the sum of 2 key, that is, when we have a key plus b key, here it will give us a plus b, then into bracket a square minus a b plus b square. Then here, this will give us x plus x minus y then into bracket here we have x square then minus x times x minus 5 then plus b square here as x minus 5 all square then close bracket from here then equals to 0. We equate it to 0 here. Then when we solve on this side, we have x plus x. That will give us 2x here. Then minus 5. Close bracket. Then open bracket. Here we have x square. Here minus x open bracket. We have minus x square now. The minus times minus becomes plus 5x. Then here. Expanding this bracket give us x square minus 10x plus 25 from here. Close bracket which is equal to 0. Then next we can reduce this you know, bracket and this becomes 2x minus 5. Now into bracket here x, minus x square minus x square cancel out. Then we have x square less. Then we have plus 5x minus 10x. We mean minus 5x. Then we have plus 25 less. Then equals to 0 from here. Then in the next step, this we have 2x minus 5 equals to 0. Or we have x square minus 5x plus 25 equals to 0 from here. Then when we solve on this side, this gives us 2x equals to 5. And uh, it implies that we have x equals to 5 over 2 here. Yeah? And we divide both sides by 2. Then next, we solve the other side as well. 
to get the value of x and we use the formula x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a and here we have a to be equals to 1 and b is minus 5 then c here is 25 so when solving this now this gives us x now equals to minus minus 5 plus or minus square root of minus 5 square then minus 4 times 1 then times 25 all over 2 times 1 then when we solve here this gives us x now equals to 5 plus or minus square root of minus 5 square that's 25 then minus here 4 times 1 times 25 that's 100 then all over 2 from here then next this gives us x equals to 5 plus or minus square root of here 25 minus 100 we have minus 75 then over 2 then from here I write root minus 75 as root 25 times 3 times minus 1 and here when we separate root 25 out that's 5 root 3 then root minus 1 here is i so it implies that here we have x equals to 5 plus or minus 5 root 3i then all over 2 and when we separate this we have x now equals to 5 over 2 plus or minus 5 root 3i also over 2 from here and here we have two other solutions here which are complex that like is we have if we say this is x1, x2 now we give us 5 over 2 plus here we have 5 root 3 high over 2 from here then also the x3 from here will be minus now that is the other you know solution now will be 5 over 2 then minus 5 root 3 i then over 2 so we have three solutions now so far then also the second case here we have it in form of difference of two q that is a cube minus b cube here will be was a minus b then into bracket open bracket a square plus a b then plus b square close bracket so when we apply that here this become x minus into bracket x minus 5 then close bracket then open bracket we have x square plus x into bracket x minus 5 close bracket then plus into bracket x minus 5 all square close bracket which we then be equals to 0 from here then when we solve this here minus open bracket and we have x minus x then plus 5 then close bracket then open bracket here we also have x square here then x open this bracket we have plus x square minus 5x then the expansion here gives us x square minus 10x plus 25 then close bracket equals to 0 from here then when we simplify again x minus x cancel out this left with 5 into bracket here we have x square plus x square plus x square it was 3 x square the minus 5 x minus 10 x here we have minus 15 x then plus 25 
close bracket now equals to zero from here then we can divide through by five here and here this side will remain three x squared minus 15 x plus 25 plus 5 will I cancel this 5 then 0 divided by 5 is 0 here then we have this quadratic equation also using the formula x a plus 2 minus b plus or minus 24 b squared minus 4 ac over 2a and here a is 3 and b is minus 16 and c here is 25 now when we solve here this becomes x now equals to minus minus 15 plus or minus square root of b square that's minus 15 square then minus 4a that's 3 then c 25 then over 2a that's 2 times 3 and when we solve this further we have x now equals to here we have 15 plus or minus here we have square root of minus 15 square that's 225 then minus 4 times 3 times 25 we have minus 300 then over 2 times 3 here that gives us 6 then from here this becomes x equals to 15 plus or minus square root of here give us minus 75 then over 6 from here then when we solve this further we have x equals to 15 plus or minus here give us 5 with 3 i that is we have 25 times 3 times minus 1 then or divided by 6 from here and when we separate this this gives us x equals to 15 over 6 then plus or minus 5 root 3i over 6 then here we can reduce this and 3 we divide on this side then we have 3 in 15 that's 5 and 3 in 6 that's 2 then plus or minus 5 root 3i over 6 and from here we also have two other complex solutions from here then write this out now as the fourth solution here and to be 5 over 2 plus 5 root 3 high over 6 and the fifth solution here we have 5 over 2 minus 5 root 3 high over 6 so all together from here we have this solution here one real solution here as 5 over 2 and we have four four other complex solutions here and thank you for watching don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell share this video give it a thumbs up we have another way of solving this put it in the comment section see you next class and bye for now